Let's compare the fractions 1 third and 3 sixths. So we want to know which fraction is greater than the other. As we look at this, we could probably just reason this out. 3 sixths, that's just 1 half. 3 goes into 6 two times. So 1 third and 1 half. So if you had an object, you divide it into 3 pieces or that same object into 2 pieces, which one would have bigger pieces? What's well, the one you divide it into 2? So 1 half is bigger than 1 third. The other way you could do this is you could find a common denominator, something that goes into both 3 and 6. If we have the same denominator, we could just compare the numerators. So let's do that. 3 times 2, that equals 6. And down here we already have 6, so let's just keep that the same as 3 6. We can't just multiply the denominator by 2. We also need to multiply the numerator by 2. 2 over 2, that's just 1. So we're multiplying by 1. We don't change the value just the way it's represented. 1 times 2 is 2, and 2 sixths and 1 third, they're equivalent fractions. But now we have a denominator of 6 for both of these. We're just going to compare the numerators. 3 is greater than 2. 3 sixths, that's greater than 2 sixths by 1 sixth, but it's greater. And since these are equivalent, they have the same value, 3 sixths, that's also going to be bigger or greater than 1 third. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.